Yo guys, what is going on? This is Real American Studios, and I'm bringing you my first review video of Pokemon Advanced. And uh, how are you guys doing today? Today, we are reviewing Pokemon Advanced Episode 1, Get the Show on the Road. And speaking of which, let's get this show on the road. But before we do that, make sure to follow me on Twitter and Instagram and join my Discord, all are linked below. Also, make sure to follow me on Twitch, twitch.tv slash realamericanstudios. We just got done with our first stream over there. And so far, I have to say it's pretty lit. And, uh, well, this is going to be an unprofessional moment because, I don't know, it's just not looking centered to me. And it's still not looking centered to me. Still not. And that's good, I, I think. I don't know. But anyways, we're going to be doing it in an interesting way. We're going to be doing it from my phone, believe it or not. So, um, yeah, I'm going to be watching on my phone and reacting to it while I'm watching. So, let's get this show on the road. I'm actually going to turn this volume all the way up. Well, maybe not all the way up. If you guys did not know, I have a little bit of an ear infection, so I really can't hear right now. Actually, I'll be right back. I need to go shut my door. Alright, so I'm back. Now, let's literally get this show on the road. Max volume. Yeah. Hi, my name's May and I'm ten years old. So obviously, this is the introduction. So yeah. I'm on my way to meet my dad's friend, Professor Birch, and to get my beginner's Pokemon. Then I can begin my journey as a Pokemon trainer. But just between you and me, what I'm more interested in is traveling and seeing new places. So, we find out an interesting fact about May right off the bat. She's more in it for the traveling rather than, you know, becoming a Pokemon master and all that stuff, so. There it is. Little Root Town up ahead. <laughs> okay. Let's see. So, right off the bat, we kind of get like a comedic type thing. We're like, uh. A dust skull appears out of nowhere. Which, speaking of which, that makes no sense because in the games, you never see a dust skull anywhere near Little Root Town. But you know what? The anime and the games, they literally don't correlate really at all. So We're literally 40 seconds in. I've already paused like six times to say something. So like, I apologize for that. We're going to get better as this progresses. But right now, this is just my first review. He, he kind of like acts like he's gonna check on it. He's like, "Oh no, what have I done?" It's like he's running away from a murder scene. Like, "Oh no, I just killed her. I gotta get out of here for the cops show up." Okay. Oh goodness! Wow! It's a lake. It's like it's like she's never seen one of those before. I just love it. And speaking of which, later on in the series, we'll actually learn where Bay's from, which it'll actually make more sense, you know, so. Oh, wait, I, I probably need to skip this part before I get copyrighted for having the whole theme song. So, as you can see, every episode, Ash is going to be reading. Come, come on, we already know Ash is the main character. He's going to be reading the intro, so. Still determined to become a Pokemon master, Ash and his best friend Pikachu continue their quest as they sail toward... Oh, wait, I, I just now realized that. So, May, when she's looking over the lake, sees a boat on the, on the water, and I just now realized that boat is actually where Ash and Pikachu are, so... Uh, obviously, everybody that watches this knows who Ash and Pikachu are, so... I mean, if you don't, you must have been living under a rock. I don't know. But, like, 
Um, but I mean, like, I just now realized that that's actually a good way to introduce Ash and Pikachu into this. So, you know, that's actually really awesome. The Hoenn region. But right now, there's only one thing on Ash's mind. Oh, just Pikachu. try to rest, Pikachu. As soon as we dock, I'm going to take you right over to the Pokemon Center. Poor Pikachu. Yeah, Pikachu's sick to start off. So. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Little Root Town. Prepare for arrival. Little Root Town? The city whose colors will never change. Huh? That's right. Little Root Town has remained true to its roots. Oh, by the way, it unless you've been living under a rock, you already know Jesse James, Meow, the villains. Villains. Like, I say that loosely because, like, literally, like, the least, you know the least bad, bad guys I've ever seen in my life, which actually adds to the comedic effect of it. Uh, I really hate this, because this, like, reflects off my glasses, and it looks absolutely ridiculous, so I've got to get, like, some lighting for that. Like, there's a lot of things that's on my wish list, guys, like, that, you know, it's going to take time to get, so, you know. But hopefully the quality of my videos will be improving overall, you know, over time. I guess my colors have slowly been changing over the years. What do you mean? Jesse, have you been here before? Mm -hmm. Is this really all that there is? Huh? Following the twerp and trying to catch Pikachu? James, have we ever truly blasted off at the speed of light? Is she speaking hypothetically? If that means wacky, then yes. Ah, All right, sure. Well, off the bat, you know, Jesse's acting weird. Sir, could you tell me where the Pokemon Center Okay, now I am going to point out, Literu Town looks more like a city than a town in the show. It looks completely different from the game, but I mean, you know, what the, what the heck can you do? I'm afraid this... Also, since this show is geared more towards kids, I am going to try to keep like my cursing to a minimum, if, like, out of it all the way, if possible, so... Town doesn't have a Pokemon Center. Huh? Oh. See, now that makes sense, because in the game it didn't have a Pokemon Center. Logic. So poor Pikachu's just gonna, like, sweat die. Right off the bat, okay. Is this Professor nice, Pikachu's laboratory? got the flu and he's gonna I'm die. From Town. I'm it's just an kidding, emergency. guys. Don't sue. I didn't just ruin your hopes and dreams. I'll let you know Pikachu's not gonna die. Actually, I kinda just spoiled it, so... What? Your Pikachu's ill. That's terrible. Well, unfortunately, Professor Birch is out in the field right now conducting an experiment. Stay put, Ash. I'll try and get in touch right, with so him. Alright, so this dude, Great. this dude Thanks looks like lot. he should be straight out as, like, Yu-Gi-Oh or something. Like, <laughs> yeah, green hair dude. It's okay. Everything's gonna be just fine now. <laughs> Alright, so I'm just gonna point out some logic here. If Pikachu's, like, if his electric powers are, like, short-circuiting or something, wouldn't you not want to wrap him up in a blanket? Like, because that's just going to overheat him more, right? No, I'm just saying. But don't ask questions. Just go along with it. Also, guys, on Twitch, I'm thinking about doing, like, a showdown stream. And I'm also thinking about doing showdown battles versus, like, viewers here on YouTube, so let me know in the comments if you guys want to see that, and if you want to see more of these. Wingle. Okay. I'm, I'm, I'm just, like, every time I see Wingle's arm stretched out like this, Wingle! Like, I just think of, like, Plank from Ed, Ed, and Eddie. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> now, I can't even tell if Pikachu at this point is not able to breathe or if he's asleep, but I can't even tell if Holy nuts. Like, this man comes skidding in. Dust coming up behind him. Like, this man's... Like, Professor Birch, you gotta slow your roll, man. Like, you're going 50 and a 25. Are you Ash More like 90 and a 25. Catch him. And I'm just gonna point out, when you look at Professor Birch, you expect a more husky, like... You expect a more husky, country-sounded voice. Doesn't sound at all like what you would expect him to sound just by looking at him. Yes, are you Professor Birch? Let me see. Not good. Let's get into my lab immediately. Oh. I see. Symptoms 
symptoms of electrical discharge. What's that mean? What symptom? Pikachu is unable to release its electricity regularly, so... What did I just say? Ash. He's short-circuited. Don't wrap him up in a blanket. But randomly sparks like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a serious problem that sometimes occurs among electric types. Tell me, has Pikachu been exposed to any magnetic fields? Yeah, that's it. Yeah. Pikachu was strapped to a magnet. That's it. An electromagnet, probably. Better watch out, Pikachu about to claw both your eyes out. Or is confusing it. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Pikachu! This is bad. We've got to get into the Pikachu lab. Pikachu looking like a whole thunderstorm out here. Look out! Pikachu! 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 This man just drove up a he, he just drove up a mountain, like literally all on the side of a like mountain. Like what is logic? That cartoon logic. I might see if we got some SpongeBob on here because like I might I might wait react this way, Bob. Professor. Everything is in place and ready for you. Thank you. This way, Ash. Alright, so Pikachu. Obviously, like, you know, I'm just joking. Like, obviously I don't want Pikachu to die. Like, I like Pikachu. I mean, I'm not gonna lie. He's a cool dude, you know, like Pikachu, we should honestly hang out sometime, my dude. Application set. What's that? A device that will rid Pikachu of all its trapped electricity. Mm. Power on, Joshua. Yes, sir. I'm gonna stop, try to stop pausing when I talk. That's a whole barbecue right there now. And then of course we start off with Pikachu running away like, was Ash abusing Pikachu in between seasons? Like, no, I'm, I'm kidding guys, like, obviously I know he wasn't. But wait, so. we had set those Pokeballs aside for May, remember? There's no choice, but you get May. just tell her to wait. May doesn't deserve a Pokemon. She only cares about traveling. No, but I'm just gonna point out how you know. Obviously, now I know Maze Ten, but like back when I was like eight, like I literally had the biggest crush on Maze. Pikachu's internal electricity is too high. A disturbance of any kind in Pikachu's electrical field could cause a massive explosion. I was actually like five or six. This thing came out in 2003. They used to play it on Cartoon Network every day at the same time. So we split up and search for it. I always like watching these. So I literally haven't yep, watched these since my childhood. But he had an emergency in the mountains, but asked that you wait for him here. Oh, then I'll go find him. Wait, hold on. I've never been much good at waiting. Bye. <sighs> Please, kids, always in a hurry. <sighs> Pikachu! Pikachu! It's funny, because he looks like a kid, too. Come on out, Pikachu. Pikachu. No, Pikachu, don't do it. Don't do it, Pikachu. You, Pikachu. No. Where are you hiding? We got Professor Birch's plunge and so Hey, it's more like the game. He just angered a Poochiena. Oh, hi there. Sorry for just dropping in on you like that, Poochiena. Now, this isn't like the game. Hey, but honestly, Birch, you're a grown man. You're a big dude. Like, you should be able to just, like, take these poochie in us and just yeet them. Yeet. Yeet us to fetus. Uh, that's not I mean, a... let's be honest. These poochie in us are about the size of a fetus. I always thought poochie in was big, but, like, even mighty in us not that big. Friendly greeting. No, doesn't sound sad either. So, that leaves one thing. You're angry. Well, no crap, Birch. Birch out here running like dang F Frosty the Snowman or something. Can we discuss this? Birch is high stepping, mate. 
gonna point out so water gun didn't hurt me but yet it's supposed to hurt other Pokemon like logic took out three Poochianas, like he sent out enough water, but when it came to May, it's just a few sprinkles. Not bad. Okay. You know, I feel like uh, you know, a gamer would actually be really good at doing stuff like this, but honestly, I want to suggest this, though. Oh, it was nothing. You've really grown up a lot since I last saw you, May. Professor, what's going on? What were you doing up in that tree? There's really no time for this, May. We'll catch up this, later. So we got Pikachu walking around with his eyes closed like Brock. Just stay Pikachu's eyes turning red like Pikachu's possessed by a demon. That's the only way you can explain what's going on here. Yeah. Look at that, my beard and mustache are just looking like powerful right now. I need a haircut. Let's see, uh... I can't wait to get a new mic. Like, my mom, like, she she says she's gonna have, like get me a mic for my birthday. So, you know, right now we are researching, especially like with the Mike King Corfish uses, because he'll let us know. And I also want to get a new webcam. And I've obviously got to get lighting because this like the way it's glinting off my glasses is just bad. You can't help a ticking time bomb, Ash. See, like, in the, in the camera light, it looks like I'm drinking freaking pee right now. Well, he's going to catch Pikachu in this can. It's Shucky! It's actually Lantern. That's Shucky. We all know, if you watch Original 151, you know Shucky. Alright, so he caught Pikachu. Pikachu's probably gonna explode all over him. Um, that sounded bad. Pikachu's probably gonna explode, gonna blow the tree branch up, and then they're all gonna, like, you know, that's the end of the series after one episode. I mean, Psych Boy, you thought that was gonna happen. Oh, I just realized I'm terrible at these. I can't. I, I'm trying to keep the like the commentary and comedy level up but I'm also trying to watch this like it's hard hey Pikachu's no longer a demon Yay! Mm. I'm not even gonna lie. Like, I don't know. I'm freaking itching or something. Like, man, it's like once you get it in your head, you know. Get y'all better, okay? I'm 
fine. I know you didn't mean it, little buddy. Prepare for trouble? Hmm. What's the point? Oh, well. Okay. Well, they're just trying to tire these guys, all these people out by like episode one. Trainer Z, so shout out to him. My solar partner, my dude. Alright, so Pikachu wore itself out by using all the electric shots. So Pikachu's probably just got to take a long rest, and he's going to be fine. And we're going to get all of the series. It's going to be fun. And I'm going to continue doing these. Pikachu. A good night's sleep ought to do the trick. Oh, oh, May about knocked it up. I thought she was about to hit Ash over the head with it. And I'm Ash Ketchum from Pallet Town. So I don't remember this from my childhood. Sleeping pretty good, finally. By tomorrow, Pikachu should be good as new. That's good news. Well now, May, are you ready to choose your first Pokemon? What? Your first Pokemon? These Pokeballs contain three big... It's just like the regular games. You spend 20 minutes doing a bunch of bull crap, and then you finally get to choose your starter. Inner Pokemon. Mm. First up. Trico. Trico. So That's is it my water man. type? No, Ash, it's a grass type. Shut up. Remember when uh, Leroy did a walkthrough of Pokemon Sapphire, and he nicknamed his Trico Tree Ninja? That was an iconic nickname. Cool. Fire up. Uh -huh. 
speaking of fire types, I still love Charizard. Well, this one's not so bad. I like it. That's that. I choose Torchic. Torchic. Be sure to take that Pokéhex and those Poké. All right, I'm just gonna point out Torchic kind of looks like that little bird thing from Digimon. Uh. I can't remember what it's. It's the one that other girl had. I don't know. I don't remember. Like I'm, I'm literally going back to my childhood right now. So. Balls too. If you work hard, you can become an even better Pokemon trainer than your father. Sounds. Oh yeah, you already know it, bro. Like a great goal, man. Yeah. Yeah, Birch looked like he'd be Thanks, lifting Ash. though. I give up Pokemon. Birch be pumping some for serious iron. Let me tell you something. Right what now. was that, man? Oh yeah, May. May's in it for the wrong reasons. But I mean, over time, like obviously this is the first episode, so you know with each character, over time you're gonna like no matter what the series is, for the most part you're gonna see character development over time. So you know that's the good thing about like you know series like this, like, especially with anime and cartoons and all that. Like depending on the series, if it's got like a story you're following. You know, like this does have a story that you're following, so and you'll see it more like in the next coming episodes. But like, you know, over time you're gonna see character development. I mean, you're gonna meet new people over time, so you know that's gonna be the cool thing about it too. So. Mm. Oh, my gorgeous bike. This is all that Pikachu's fault. I've got a bone to pick with them. See, that's the downside about it. Now you're kind of following the same storyline that you did in season one with Misty, which, I mean, I'm not, like, extremely upset about it. Like, it's cool and all, but at the same time, like, you know, you could have done something else with it, you know, maybe. I mean, I don't really have any suggestions for it, because, I mean, what's the point in suggesting it if it's already been done? Quote me on that. What's the point of suggesting it if it's already done? Rast, 2019. Hmm. Oh. And, then, and then she probably falls in love with Ash because, you know, every girl goes crazy over guys sleeping. At least they do at 10. At my age, it's about other things. You kids will find out later in life. Oh. He's been taking care of his Pikachu all night long. Pikachu. See, May, now you can learn a thing or two about this. This is what it means to be a Pokemon trainer. Ash loves traveling, but he really cares about his Pokemon. And May, May, like, Ash should take a freaking Pokeball and thump you over the head with it for this. Uh. No, he shouldn't. That's violent. And we don't get violent in Pokemon. I mean, I guess technically we do, but... Pikachu. Yeah, let's just stretch this out for the watch time! So Pikachu's gonna be cuddling with Ash. Pikachu's feeling better. Praise Jesus. Praise God. Praise the Lord. G uh, Pikachu's feeling better. Praise oh, Arceus. So <laughs> but yeah... Well, for the most part, that's episode one, so I can't say I didn't enjoy it. Well, good morning, Torchic. Pikachu's all right. Yeah. That's great. Torchic. Torchic. They're already friends. You know, that didn't exactly happen with my dog and the other dogs in my house. Like, they kind of had to get used to each other. But now, like, all they do is play, especially, like, my dog, which Cookie's a terrier. And then I've got Missy, a chihuahua, and Kirby, who is a uh, Pomeranian. And, you know, they all like to play. So, you know, it's it's cute when they play. Like, it's so funny. Cute. That's all they do all day, too. found your first friend here in Hoenn, Pikachu. Oh, 
Oh, she did exactly what Misty should have done. So, you know, obviously the show, like, that's just like now a you commercial break. register for the Hoenn League at the nearest Pokemon Center you can find, okay? okay? And the closest town where I think you'll be able to find one is Oldale Town. Okay, thanks. So, it's literally just like the anime. Uh. Like, uh, place-wise. Sorry, I had to scratch my back. Sorry, I, I don't know why I'm itching late right now. Sight boys. Like, once you scratch a spot, like, once you give in and scratch a spot, everywhere else is going to itch. Like, we all know this, so it's a fact. Rest 2019. Or, uh, once you scratch one spot, every other spot's going to itch. Rest 2019. We've gotten two quotes from Rass in this episode. Walking all that way alone makes me nervous. And my bike. Oh, man, it looks. Oh. Nope, May, May is resorting to those things. May acting like she want to cuddle over here. She looking for a new man. She thinking Ash is that new man. Destroyed. Thanks to your Pikachu, mister. There we go. <laughs> there must be a solution. May, you disappoint me. A way to get to Old Downtown safely on foot. Hey, go. Hey, why don't we go there together? Oh, she thinks this is the day. I happen to know the way there. Uh, really, Ash, I don't mind at all. It's no trouble, really. Shall we? Well, okay. We'll go together. Yes. Uh, that's a good idea. You. Well, she she's happy. She's happy. Okay. Look after one another. Yes, be careful. Don't worry, we will. Thanks a lot. Hi, Mom. So with Pikachu fully recovered, Ash and May can begin their journey together as they head it's for Oldale Town day. and the nearest Pokemon Center. Together oh, they're sure trick. to discover new Pokemon and new friends as well. One thing's for sure, even more yeah. new adventures lie just ahead. And that's episode one. So, um, you know... It's not going to be the most interesting episode in the series. It's not going to be the least interesting episode in the series. So, you know, I mean, there's that. Overall, though, like, this brings back so many memories from my childhood. I'm excited to be getting back into this. And, I mean, yeah, you know, that's pretty much it. So, um, again, follow me on Twitch, twitch.tv slash Real American Studios. And with that being said, Real American Studios out. Peace out. All my home dogs.